What's up you guys? So I wanted to make a quick video where we take a tour of my new place. So let's get this thing turned around and check it out. All right, so off to the right, we've got my office here, but we're not gonna be checking that out today. It's a little messy right now, and I'm waiting for some new furniture to come in. Um, but off to the left, let's go ahead and check out the two spare bedrooms first. So in here, this room is actually set up as a spare bedroom. Uh, we've got some pretty nice carpet and a queen size bed. And over in the closet, it's actually ventilated. I think all the closets are ventilated, so that way they can all be temperature controlled, climate controlled. Uh, but we've got some laminate countertops over here on each side of this uh, Jack and Jill bathroom. And I think all of these um, drawers and uh, cabinet doors throughout the whole house are soft closed, so that's pretty nice. Uh, we've got kind of a seating area here and some more storage between both of the bathrooms. And then of course we've got the uh, stand-up shower and the shared toilet right there. And then there's the sink on this side, kind of a mirror image of the other side. And in here is the second bedroom. Uh, right now we're kind of just using it as a storage area or a second living room for our couch that we used to have in our basement in our previous house, so it's just kind of hanging out in here right now. And then here's the entryway again, back out to the small foyer and opening up to the living room. So these windows face the east side of the house, so you get pretty good light in the morning. Then up here is our TV. Uh, that wasn't easy to mount, took a little bit of modification. Then down here, we've got the gas fireplace. So it's pretty easy to, to work with. I love them when you know you can just flip the switch and you've got a nice, easy gas burning fireplace. Um, so here's, again, the east side of the house. And uh, I wanna make another video soon that talks about like my 15 favorite features of this place. Uh, and one of them is gonna be the backyard and actually the side yard there's uh, some protected wetland areas, so uh, no one can build on those. And there's the south side. And over here we've got the open concept kitchen that faces out towards the living room. We've got our wine rack down there. And over here the range hood is vented, so that's something that I'm always a fan of when it actually vents to the exterior and doesn't just circulate the air. Built-in microwave, modern light fixtures. And over here we've got the, I guess, smaller pantry that's right inside the kitchen. And then the butler's pantry that's just across the hallway. So outlets and plenty of storage in there. Kind of nice to be able to leave the toaster and some of the smaller appliances in there and just use them to keep all your counter space freed up. Uh, then over here is the master bedroom. Some lighting coming in off of the east side again. Coffered ceilings and um, also this fan I think is pretty interesting. I haven't gotten up there and felt it yet. I don't know if it's a real wood or not, but uh, we've got two fans in here like that and I think those are pretty cool. Pretty decent sized room with some carpet in here. And then uh, we go over to the master bathroom with double sinks, solid surface countertop. I think this is quartz, so pretty nice. And then tiled floor. And over here we've got a full floor to ceiling tiled shower. little linen closet off to the left and we've got uh, the toilet over there and here's the closet um, well we've got quite a few pocket doors so those are kind of nice freeing up some space and then this closet is bigger than we can handle fortunately we can't fill it up yet so I don't plan to anytime soon but at least it's got plenty of storage for all of our stuff right now
And then off of the master closet is the laundry room. So we're waiting on our appliances to come in now. Those haven't been the easiest thing to get a hold of at this time. And a little folding area over here. Well, that's it for now. Like I said, stay tuned for the next video where we're going to talk about some of my favorite features of this place and go into some more detail. So until next time, we'll see you guys then.